Hello, 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 everyone. I'm a little late um, because <laughs> right before stream, I was like, let me do my taxes. Um, and then I only got like halfway through them before I got to a question that I'm going to need help with my mom for that. So I paused them and I figured I would come do stream instead. Um, I will admit I'm having a bit of a rough morning. The world is awful. The world sucks and everything is bad. But <laughs> here we are, despite it, here we are because of it. Um, and I'm going to forget that for a while and live in the Sims world, where the worst thing that can happen to you is um, the cow plant being hungry or the dryer catching fire <laughs> or fire dryer. Um, and yeah, I'm just going to forget about the world for a um, couple hours, hopefully. At least till my mom gets home um, and I can continue doing my taxes. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere today. I am not leaving the house. Um, so let's hop into some Sims because I'm, I'm ready for it. It's been it's been a weird um, not even a full 24 hours, like 12 hours <laughs> for me. Um, and I would like to forget it. I would like to move on to some sim stuff. And gain the power of voodoo. You know? <laughs> Bianca still has a voodoo doll of um, Martina, if I remember correctly. But voodoo is kind of lame in the sim, it turns out. Hey, Panda, how you doing this morning? I am okay. Um, I've had a weird 12 hours, <laughs> but it was it's nothing to do with this morning. This morning has actually been all right. I'm just in a world weird mental state because um, I got essentially made fun of to my face without them realizing it last night. It was great. It was wonderful. Um, <laughs> so I'm going to try to forget it um, and and instead play some sims <laughs> i i did already sort of talk about it on tiktok panda um and i i'm i'm not even like fully upset because i know i did nothing wrong and i'm the one in the right here but it's just upsetting that the world is shitty you know um i went to the gym and i was doing leg day stuff and i was doing hip thrusts which admittedly are a very sus looking workout they <laughs> you look like you're trying to fuck the the weight admittedly um but they are a workout they work out your glutes and i heard two of the uh, the only two other people that were in the gym at that point i paused my music after i finished the first set and i heard them like out loud making fun of me not even like whispering to each other like fully like yelling making fun of me and that they had filmed me doing it and were sending it to their friends um and I just, you know, since then I've had a little bit of a tough time. <laughs> I've had a little bit of a weird 12 hours mentally because of it. Um, yeah, yeah. Like I said, I, I'm i only shaken because I, it's so fucked up. Like, I know I'm in the right. I know they're being assholes here. It's not me. Like, I'm doing a workout that they don't know, so they think I'm being weird and they're being assholes because of it. Um... So, like, I know I did nothing wrong. I'm not upset over that. It's just, like, fucked that the world is so fucked that they think that that's, like, a cool, fun thing to do for them, you know? <laughs> so, I'm trying to get over it because I'm thinking, why am I going to be upset over assholes being assholes? But it is it is tough, you know? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Because I heard them saying, like, what is that even working out? And it's like, yeah, I get it. Like, you don't you don't know that it's a workout. And being the workout that it is, it does look a little weird. I get it. I get it. It's why I went there at 9 p.m. Because I didn't want there to be people in the gym while I went while I was doing this workout. <laughs> um, but yeah, even even if I was doing the workout wrong or whatever, like everybody's fitness journey is different and just because someone's doing something weird in the gym doesn't give you permission to film it 
Like, it's a very vulnerable space, and, you know, it's just fucked. Because now I'm, I'm considering not even going to that gym anymore. There's another one in the town, like, town over that I can go to that still works with the same, like, key cart and everything. But, like, yeah, I'm trying not to let it stop me. I'm pretty sure I'm still going to keep going, but it's just, like, stupid that I, it's something I have to consider and think about now, you know? I hate it. <laughs> I appreciate letting me event though, Panda. Um, I'm gonna try not to focus on it the whole whole day because I've literally been focusing on it like solely for the t last 12 hours, and I would like to just move on, you know, <laughs> like to move on from the shitty thing that shitty people did and uh, hang out with people who I like and enjoy, and um, do an activity that I think is fun. <laughs> Like, hacking my work performance to be better. Yeah. No, it's just silly. Because sending it to their friends and, like, the way they were talking about it, it sounds like this is something that they've, like, been making fun of me for. Because this is not the first time I've done this workout in the gym. Um, so just, like, it's now a whole thing of, like, I have to worry about being perceived in the gym. When, like, I'm trying my hardest to make sure I'm not looking at anybody ever while I'm in there, you know? Like, I'm, like, head down, look at your phone, like, <laughs> don't pay attention to what anybody is doing, you know? But I've also seen someone else do that workout, so, you know? I'm glad that I have y'all, and I'm glad that everybody in the world is not shitty, you know? <laughs> that's, that's the takeaway I've been trying to have with this at the end of the day, is, like... Not everybody is shitty. You just encountered some shitty people doing a shitty thing. You know? Shitty people gonna be shitty. <laughs> it's why Bianca's so mean all the time. She is a mean sim. You know? I don't even know if it's worth, worth making a complaint to the gym... Um, I considered saying something to them, honestly, because I I believe they thought I couldn't hear them, um, because my music was too loud, and admittedly, while it was on, I couldn't, um, but, like, they were, like, ten feet to my right, and, like, this volume making fun of me, um, so I considered going up to them and being like, hey, like, if you're gonna make fun of people, like, make sure they can't hear you next time, maybe, and then walking out of the gym... Um, but even then, I was just like, you know what, that's frankly still sinking down to their level. I just don't give a shit in the end. You can think whatever you want about me, you can call me weird, you can make fun of me to your friends. Like, I'm in the gym doing my workout and minding my own business. At the end of the day, I'm the one in the right here. <laughs> so, I don't even know if I'm gonna complain, I don't know if I need to say anything to them. I think I'm just gonna continue to let shitty people be shitty, um, because... That's punishment in, it, in itself enough for me, you know? <laughs> yeah, a couple of people, I, I posted on TikTok and a couple of people have said the same thing, that like I should have said something to them. It's just like, I don't think it's worth it in the end, you know? I don't think it would have made them feel any worse about it. I don't think they would have felt bad. I wouldn't have gotten an apology, I guarantee. Um, and in the end, what is that doing for anybody, you know? So I'm going to move on from it. I'm gonna let them think shit their shitty thoughts and be shitty people. And I'm gonna continue to be who I am, you know? <laughs> I'll be a little upset over it for a little bit, but I'll get over it, you know? At the end of the day, I'm not gonna spend my energy thinking about them, you know? <laughs> a badass bitch. Thank you, Panda. I appreciate that. The real kicker for me, though, is that they, like, they think I'm doing this, like, made-up workout, and it's, like, people on TikTok have been like, well, they're the ones who don't know what hip thrusts are. <laughs> like, it's a pretty common workout, frankly. <laughs> but I'm certainly, I am not leaving the house today. I'm fucking... <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nobody ruining my day today except for my myself and the government uh, because I do have to do my taxes. So only only one person is allowed to ruin my day today, and that's me. 
I didn't even notice Vikram come down the stairs. When did that happen? Yeah, I'm gonna have some chocolate. I'm gonna hang out around the house and smoke weed. <laughs> it's gonna, <laughs> it's a self care day for sure. <laughs> Welcome on in, Nico. How you doing this afternoon? Oh, she succeeded, Bianca. I love you. Oh my God, we might actually get promoted within her lifetime now. <laughs> um, and you can come hang out with Vikram. I feel like you guys don't really, um, hang out all that often these days anymore. Would you like to woohoo? Uh, woohoo, even, maybe? Perhaps. Mayhaps. <laughs> it's told me the rest of the day, honestly, Nico, great minds think alike, you know? <laughs> but that's what Saturdays are for, frankly. I'm excited to do nothing today, frankly. It might be nice later on if I finish my taxes early and I, like, have enough time before, um, a second stream. I might even go for a run today in in the, the reservoir near me. Although, admittedly, the last time I went to the reservoir for a run... I thought y'all were gonna woohoo. Um, I did almost get attacked by a goose. Um... <laughs> And when I say almost, I mean, like, I had to book it so that the goose did not attack me. <laughs> it was a little scary. I was, like, walking down the the path in the reservoir that's near me. And there are geese there, and they're usually, they'll let you go by, you know. Um, but I saw this one singular goose on the path. He was over on, like, this side of it. And so I was like, oh, cool. I'll, like, I'll walk around this side. It'll all be good. And he did, like, a 360 he slowly turned as he watched me approach, and then he started, like, coming towards me, and so I was like, oh, let me just, like, pick up the pace then, and then he, like, came at me. He, like, hissed and, like, went like that, and I was just like, oh, shit, and I, like, booked it. <laughs> it was, it was a little scary. Um, so maybe I'll avoid that part of the res, uh, if I do go for a run today, but... The world in general is a scary place lately. I I would like to stay at my house 24-7, I think. <laughs> Hello, Monique. Well, you, how are you doing this afternoon? Welcome on in. I tried to mix that all into one sentence. It came out sort of as like a, wow, are you doing? <laughs> Welcome on in. How are you doing? Wow, are you doing? <laughs> my brain's a little messy today. I'm not going to lie. Um, a goose. A goose tried to kill me. <laughs> I didn't let it, though. Ain't no goose getting the best of me. Why am I doing? <laughs> yeah, I ask that question every time I wake up, too. <laughs> I hope you are uh, feeling a lot better, though, today, Monique. Um, what are you doing? You're trolling the Teff forums? That's actually fine. You can do that. Oh, that was loud. Why did both the dogs just become tense? Oh my god, because it's fucking... It's like, flooding as hell in here. That's why. Flooded as hell on the floor. Oh my god, fishing. Sometimes in games it's the worst action. <laughs> Don't let Nico hear you say that, but... I, yeah, I'm I'm well known for not enjoying fishing in most games. <laughs> at this point. Fishing in Minecraft is okay. Every three days real time? Oh, I hate that. I hate a real time time limit on something. Give me game time. <laughs> huh. Oh my god. I had to fight the goose. Yeah, real test of love. <laughs> I If someone would fight a goose for me, that's it. We're married, you know? I don't even need... <laughs> we don't need a ceremony or anything. That was the ceremony. 
if you fight a goose for me, that's that's true love. <laughs> fishing pond. <laughs> we have a nice fishing pond out back of our house. Maybe someone can get into fishing at some point now. We have this little pond right here now. Bianca, what are you doing now? You want to shower in the rain? How about no? How about probably not? Um, you can go take a pee upstairs, though. That was a trial, yeah. <laughs> Win the fight with a goose of achievement. You're married now, yeah. <laughs> I did consider, like, kicking the goose's face away from me while it was coming at me. Because <laughs> I was like, I don't want to get bit by a goose right now. <laughs> you know? Something tells me it's not on my list of, of fun activities I enjoy. Bianca, how are you still not level 8 handiness? Get good. You have a grilled cheese in your inventory. I gotta make sure I'm checking out people's inventories. They've got some silly stuff in here sometimes. <laughs> yeah, she's got animal crackers from when we went over Blake's house that one time, like... <laughs> He's got a Tooth Fairy certificate, oh, Jasper. You've probably had that since, like, you were a kid. That's cute. We can hang that up in your room. Um, it's probably a both streams type of day today. Um, I'm not going really anywhere today. Uh, and I'm doing all right. I ha I've had a weird 12 hours because of some assholes in the gym. Um, but other than that, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm, I'm happy to be here and happy to be chilling on my day off with pretty much nothing to do, with one thing to do today. <laughs> Oh my god, tomorrow's Harvest Festival? Holy cow. It feels like it was just Harvest Festival. I think we should bring the goose to the gym now that I'm thinking about it. Yeah, that would be the perfect solution. <laughs> no, it was just people making fun of me and having filmed me in the gym, which is just asshole behavior. Um, but what can you do about it? Some people are assholes, you know? I'm trying not to think about it because I've, I've spent a lot of the last 12 hours thinking about it, um, and I don't want to anymore because I don't want to give them the time of day. <laughs> yeah, that's what it comes down to. That's why I'm trying not to think about it too much because people are jerks. People are going to be jerks. And, you know, in the end, as far as things went last night, no one said anything to me. No one, no one came up to me and did anything. That's not the worst thing in the world. People are jerks, but whatever. Like, people are always going to be jerks. They make me viral. <laughs> I did make a TikTok about it, and um, people are commenting on it more than I've ever had people comment on any TikTok of mine. So, who knows? <laughs> the last one to laugh, I know, I know. <laughs> and lately this man called... Vlad Vladislaus, is that the vampire from the Vampire Pack? Oh my God, he actually has a fear of the dark now, which is great because maybe we can actually get rid of it for once. He's been afraid of the dark for forever, um, but he actually hasn't actually had the fear, so it hasn't been able to have been like fear away, you know? <laughs> maybe this will actually get rid of it. I don't have the vampire pack. That's why I was like, if, if, are they mentioning him? I don't even have it. <laughs> I I kind of wish I had the vampire pack. Um, added some extra danger to the world, you know? Vikram, where are you going? Vikram, do not go outside. What are you doing? <laughs> I don't know if I'll have any occult sims. Um... I don't currently have the possibility for them in-game, because I don't have vampires or werewolves or 
um, island living. So I, I can't be any type of a cult sim. I, I guess I could be a plant sim. Um, but that's not that's not all that exciting. I think you go back to being a regular sim after a couple of days. <laughs> I'd consider it, though, maybe. No. Nibahana. Ugh. Help. Leave us. Vikram, what are you doing right now? Why are you being like this? Where did he just put that? Oh, there it is. Well, maybe we can actually have him not be afraid anymore soon. Although this is not this is not great weather to be saying that. Why are you outside, Cashew? Also, it's 3 a.m. and everyone in the house is awake all of a sudden. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like the schedule that they're getting on to here. That's fine, though. You can be taking a bath. <laughs> Melody, you should come sit down over here. And then Jasper can come get some food. Oh my god. That was so loud. <laughs> that was like right here, wasn't it? Can things be destroyed by lightning in this game? I don't remember. Oh, someone has to feed the cow plant. Um, Bianca, you're not doing anything right now. Would you like to come feed the cow plant? Spilled the soup, oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm sorry, Monique. I didn't mean to. Yeah, no, the lightning in this game is actually like real life scary. Any amount of sudden noises like that, I hate it. Why did you X that out? No, feed the cow plant. I'm sorry, but someone's got to do it, and you're the only one not doing anything right now. <laughs> Alright, that's enough of that then. Come craft some furniture. Yeah. Bianca's busy fucking screaming at people. <laughs> Not Bianca. Melody. She wants to get struck by lightning. You know, I guess it's it she's the one that wants it. And also it's garden time probably. Oh, these are all perfect now. Oh my god. They cannot get any better. That's cool. Um, in that case, yeah. Melody, would you like to come deal with some of the plants right now? Jasper, you can go work out. You can do an epic energized workout. And Vikram is gonna cook? That's fine. What's he cooking? What is it? Vegetable casserole. Ooh. Ooh. Why are you... Oh, you're just uncomfortable because you're wet. That's fine. <laughs> are you watering everything? 
collect the honey. Bond with the bees. Birdie's bee box. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Instead of Bert's bees. Did you bond with the bees? I did not see you do so. I kind of don't like that gardener sims want to plant something as an aspirational thing every once in a while. Because what if I don't want to plant anymore? Like, I already have so many plants. I don't want another one. <laughs> you know? Don't make me. I can only handle so much responsibility in The Sims, okay? <laughs> oh. Vikram, you should maybe go pee. Huh. You're not playing it because you got addicted with Stardew, yeah. Stardew is also just one of those games that, like, once you pick it up, you're like, well, this is my next three months. <laughs> This is what I'm going to do every single day for the rest of my life. <laughs> Both The Sims and Stardew are like that. Oh my god. Stop it, lightning. I feel like it rains a lot on this lot. Did you not go to the bathroom? Come on. Oh, she got stung by the bees, too. Whoops. <laughs> Here, you can... Oh, you're too uncomfortable to play... Oh, that's unfortunate. There we go. Never mind. Come strum for fun. Dislikes handiness? No, you don't, Bianca. You're level 8 in it. <laughs> oh, Lampima. Okay, okay. Everyone's doing good. God, I love having a small house again. It is so handy to just only have to hit page up and page down to be able to see the whole house. <laughs> Why are you still scared? You, like, don't have a fear of the dark anymore. At all. It's gone gone. Wow, it's only 6.30am in game? Holy cow. Bianca's, like, mega uncomfortable for some reason. No one's done laundry yet today. No fire in the dryer today. No fire dryers. Okay, thank god. <laughs> School for Melody starts in an hour. I forgot that she worked. Uh, she uh, has school now, <laughs> and I forgot that Jasper works now. Oh my God! Um, so he should actually work on his charisma skill as well, huh? Practice that speech in the mirror. Bianca, what are you up to? 
You want to chat with Colin and become a enemies with Veer. Well, I don't even know who either of those people are, so I don't think we're going to do that. <laughs> you can instead... Oh, you work today too, huh? You can come make another mobile app. Should be Brange. Brange. We're gonna tell. <laughs> yibs, yibs, yibs. <laughs> Level 2 charisma. Hell yeah. What's Vikram up to? He's staring at the eggs and toast that he made. We love to see it. Vikram, get a hobby. <laughs> get a real job. Um, oh shit, he actually has to really get a real job. He has to start programming real quick. He needs to work on his real job. <laughs> He's the development captain. Is he like already level five of the level six of this career? That's wild. Ina <laughs> Flotsam, he won't evolve. <laughs> what a rainy day. Like, what a shitty rainy day. Work for Spikram starts in an hour, which means that B Melody should go to school right now. Seeing all the things that they get for being, you know, the aspirations that they have. <laughs> no. I thought for a second that Fabo aged up again or something. What was that? Did my dogs just mate? What was that music? Why was their hearts here? I am I am concerned now. Vikram, you should go to work. Only having done twenty percent of your programming for the day. We love to see it. Bianca's making her mobile app. And Jasper works in three hours. So he should keep working on that charisma for a little while. Off to work. We love that for you, Vikram. You know what? You can work hard today. You got through your midlife crisis, you're, you're feeling refreshed, you know? <laughs> Where is Fabo? Is he hiding under the bed? Oh, look at him under there! Fabo! I think Fabo needs a bath, actually, yeah. I was gonna say he looks a little damp and dirty. He needs a bath in his little onesie. Harvest Fest tomorrow. 
Chow Tokibo. Sika. Picked up Frenzy. Akimba. Baina Flynn. Chris. Chris. Chibi Grange. Grange. War get a toe. Catch more fish in the rain. <laughs> I don't know if I really feel like uh, fishing in a thunderstorm, though. That might be true, but I think you also catch more lightning fishing in a thunderstorm. <laughs> I don't know. This type of thunderstorm seems quite intense. I don't think I would like to be outside during this. <laughs> Get bath, Fabo. Please. He is a stinky little man and he needs a bath. Melody wants to be struck. That's true. That's true. She does have that as an aspiration right now. <laughs> But she's at school, so if she's if she gets out of school and there's still lightning and she still wants to be struck, we'll have her be, you know, outside for a little while. <laughs> we'll have her come take care of the cow plant and everything. Work for Jasper starts in an hour. We've got a stinky poop on the ground. Oh! Oh, this is where lightning struck the ground. We can we can keep the jet that happened right outside of our house. That's cool. That's like a nice little um decoration for somewhere. You know what? We can put that on the desk even. Focusing decor. <laughs> You can pet the dog for a minute before you go to work. Did you... You did just gave Fabo a bath. We love to see it. Um... <gasps> Julia's a child! Oh my god! Ah, our family is growing so fast. Wait, where's, where's John then? He's still not at all. I'm waiting for him to turn into an elder. I just feel like he's like this close, you know? She could shower there, more chance of being struck. <laughs> Bianca does want to shower in the rain half the time. <laughs> she'll have full hygiene just taking a shower, and she'll still get naked with the intention of, of uh, showering in the rain every five seconds. But you know what? She does have to come feed this cow plant right now, so she does have to go outside. I'm not letting that cow plant go hungry. Don't throw away the poop. Oh, she stepped in it. She didn't step in that. It's so far away from her. If you don't want to step in pet poop, maybe you should have trained your dogs not to poop on your front steps. <laughs> You should go to work now, Jasper. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Pause for a second. Look at him in his work outfit. <laughs> From cat boy to llama boy. He's a team mascot. <laughs> Beautiful. We fed the cow plant. Um... Bianca, you should go inside now, though. Probably. You can continue making your... She's too uncomfortable to do so? Oh, that's stupid. She's too un uncomfortable for anything. Alright, come, come relax and watch t some TV then, I guess. Where's Fabo? 
when I think relax and unwind, I think Fabo. What are we watching? Some sort of sitcom. Some sort of, like, Disney Channel sitcom. <laughs> what it looks like to me, at the very least. Farbachli instead of Full House. Alright. Relax and unwind with Fabo on the couch for a minute, and then you gotta give Cashew a bath, because Cashew is, again, a stinky little dog. <laughs> Unsurprisingly, at this point. Cashew's always a stinky little dog. I don't know why... Everybody loves relaxing and unwinding on the front porch with Fabo. I always intend for them to do it, like, in front of the TV. Like, somewhere nice, you know? Um, and instead it's always on, like, the front porch. Oh my god! <laughs> my mushroom seat got struck by lightning. A couple of my mushroom street seats got struck by lightning. No! <laughs> Wait a minute. That's no good. Gonna make sure there's no more, like, jet and stuff on our property. I feel like we've had some... In some intense lightning storms right now, you know? Gotta make sure it's not affecting everything. <laughs> Apparently, it's, it's killing our mushrooms. They adopted another cat in the Tamara household? That's Blake, by the way. Michaelsons have moved out. And nothing else has happened. Okay. Blake, stop adopting cats challenge. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's uh, the, the third cat, and he's got two dogs? That's almost a, that's almost a full household, and there's only two Sims. <laughs> Scary ass thunder crashes. But it doesn't matter. We're hanging out with Fabo. We're having a beautiful time. Oh, oh. Actually, this rain looks like it's still hitting us on the porch where we are. Um, <laughs> this is probably not the most relaxing and unwinding time <laughs> that it is supposed to be right now. I don't know. Maybe... maybe Chilling with Fabo in the rain is a really good time. Maybe maybe I'm missing out. <laughs> I probably would not. I'm gonna make sure my mushrooms all stay um, fresh. <laughs> I don't have any more lightning hitting my mushrooms. Toki Boo. I kind of want it to stop raining. I feel like it's been raining so long. <laughs>
do the laundry. Thank you, Bianca. I guess that one never got done. Okay, cool. <laughs> Can't get past her A. Kudos. Thank you, Melody. Um, would you like to... Oh, it's not raining anymore. We can't have her get struck by thunder. You can come get all the food, though. All the all the, the crops that are growing on these trees. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know you could actually see that the different crops grew on these. Because we get pears, plantains, and lemons from these trees. And then just cherries from these one, if I remember correctly. Oh, pear and cherry, I guess. These need to be weeded. They do. Oh my god, there's so many rabbits right now. We have one, two, three, four, five. Five rabbits just chilling around our house right now. <laughs> Should we hang out with the bees? Yeah, we should hang out with the bees a little bit. She wants to play the violin and chat with Raul. Did she? Yeah, she met Raul, just not as an adult. Melody got stung again. We love to see it. Not a very great beekeeper, turns out. Bianca completely X'd out getting food from the fridge, because no one can ever do what I want them to do in this house. <laughs> Done giving cash you a bath. Come get leftovers. No. No. <laughs> Hard to resist the spoils of honey. We do get a lot of honey, actually. Wow, we really make the bank. From, from Melody these days. It's where the bulk of our money is coming from. Vikram stole some dirty plates from his engineering job. That makes sense. We'll have him come take a shower. And then he can move the laundry to the dryer. Bianca is getting food. Perfect. Melody is gonna go pee. And then she's gonna uh, practice her violin, because I believe she wants to. And then that's what I was going to do. I have to go into build mode um, to put out all of the stolen things that we have in our in our inventory right now. Because we have a couple of things. <laughs> um, 
Oh, I didn't see that we got a trophy case. I love that. That's cute. And we got a... We got an award. For reaching level six of the tech guru career. I didn't even realize. That's cute. We stole this from one of our jobs. Hey, Cozy, how you doing this afternoon? Welcome on in. You came just in time to watch me update the stolen stuff room. <laughs> the stolen stuff rave, I should say, at this point. It is a bit of a rave. Got a couple people watching the giraffe perform. <laughs> how you doing this afternoon? <coughs> um, I think that's all the stuff that we've stolen. You know what, though? Are these different dining tables? I wasn't aware that Bianca could make different styled dining tables. Although I guess those are considerably worse looking ones um, than the one that is nice. <laughs> these are cute, but I'd rather not. And then um, we have we have a, a glass display case now for trophies. We can display some trophies if we can find some wall space. Hmm. A vegan burger. Ooh. I'm glad to hear, Cozy. I'm having an okay day. My my night last night was silly because of assholes at the gym, um, but my day so far today has been lovely, so it makes up for it. <laughs> um, I guess we're going to go black on that, and we only have the one trophy so far. But that's nice. I do like that. I like it a lot. Yeah, it wasn't fun, but I'm trying not to think about it because I've spent a little too long thinking about it, and I've I've come to the conclusion that assholes are going to be assholes, so I shouldn't waste time thinking about it. Um, but it has it has um had a weird effect on my mood the last twelve hours. <laughs> but we're good now. We're happy and uh chilling. You know, I'm not going anywhere today. We're having a, a full on self care day. <laughs> Welcome on in, Roy. How you doing this afternoon? Do you not have enough points for a fart? <laughs> you entered without a real fart? I'm I'm shocked, frankly. <laughs> Thank you, Cozy. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, it's just not worth my time to worry about assholes being assholes when I'm minding my own business doing a workout at the gym. Like, you know? <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> Disgusting, fully. <laughs> I'm doing pretty all right, Roy. How about you? How's your evening so far? Um, Vikram, you just got home from work, correct? Right, you're going to take a shower and then do laundry, right? Bianca's eating and talking to herself, and Melody is peeing like a champion and then playing some violin. We love to see it taking it easy we love to see it that's that seems to be the vibe today <laughs> for everybody <coughs> like nico said he's just chilling cozy seems like she's just been chilling i'm just chilling today nobody nobody has the attention span to do anything today <laughs> that's how i think it is did you not do laundry clean the lint tray dry the laundry And then add to washing machine. Why can I add those to the dryer? That seems not good. A nice chilled Saturday, yes. We love to see it. Vikram is not having fun in the slightest. Because he needs a vacation. He needs new um, surroundings. 
and he's stressed from work. All right, well, come play some Sims with mods then, I guess, because I don't think we're buying you anything new. Bianca's on her way to shower in the rain. <laughs> it does kind of feel like a Sunday panda. Um, I would start with clay, though, Cozy. I, I love clay. Even though I'm not good at it and I haven't used it in years, I love the feeling of, like, smushing clay in my hands. There's just something about it that I love it. <laughs> Bianca, can you go put some clothes on? Can you imagine if you lived with your mom and she was just, like, constantly naked? It's so like every five hours she took off all of her clothes to go shower in the rain. Like, <laughs> Bianca, you are a strange one. Not comedy. Programming. That was like right over here. You'd rather not, yeah. <laughs> I feel the same way. <laughs> Melody, you could actually make some coffee. I want you to to um, stay up this evening a little bit. Oh, but you know what? You never did your homework either. You should do your homework. Who's Colin Vikram? Nobody? Question mark? Someone was calling. <laughs> it certainly looked like someone was calling. Alright, Vikram. You can come get some food now. Actually, once you've leveled up in video gaming, I guess. Beautiful. Everyone's doing what they're supposed to be doing. Jasper's about to get home from work. The dogs are fighting. We'd love to see it. Bianca goes to work in an hour. Oh, Jasper brought home his first paycheck. And he's feeling flirty. Oh. Is tomorrow... Tomorrow's Harvest Fest. What do you mean it's time to be, be romantic? Love Day is not for weeks. <laughs> um, strange. All right, Jasper. Um, you can absolutely run inside, but you should stay up for a little while longer. Um, and probably, yeah, work out, I guess. Maybe not an epic workout, just a regular workout. Sega might acquire Angry Birds. Interesting. <coughs> Something I've been meaning to um, both get and then play on stream is recently Sega, I, I believe it's Sega, because I, I mean, they're the, the ones who owned Sonic last I knew, um, released something called, like, Who Killed Sonic the Hedgehog or something like that. It's a murder mystery video game for free on Steam based on Sonic. <laughs> um, and I really want to play it. I it's it's it even like made me question whether or not I should like continue playing this in for a moment and just like pause to go do that. <laughs> um, but I think we will play that on stream at some point because that sounds incredibly fun. <laughs> so if if Sega is going to do things like that in the future, 
I'm all for them acquiring Angry Birds. Give me an Angry Birds murder mystery. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. I think I'm going to at some point. I need to. I need to feel less in the need for Sims um, for it. But the one a day when I'm not wanting to play Sims and I'm wanting to stream, you know, we're gonna solve a, a Sonic the Hedgehog murder. <laughs> Angry birds who killed the red bird. <laughs> I feel like it would focus heavily on themes of discrimination because the birds hate the pigs based on the fact that they're pigs so much, you know? That'd be themes in this movie. <laughs> in this video game. Jasper, how are you not level 10 working out yet? Oh, you're real close. Real close. Blush. I cannot believe you haven't leveled up in video gaming yet, Vikram. You should have by now. Ah, wait, Bianca's supposed to be at work. Bianca, go to work. Go to work now. <laughs> oh, shit. I want her to get her promotion so bad. She's never going to get her promotion. She's going to be like an hour late to work. Ugh. Whoops. The thing with her is she only works two days a week, so it's really hard to get a promotion because, like, there's not enough chance to get your performance up. I essentially just have to hack and keep hoping. <laughs> Bianca, you can work hard today. She just had her coffee. She's... Feeling energized, ready to go play violin. He's working out, and he is taking care of his needs. Perfect. Zim Zay. Ballet. Play the concerto. Can you not reach it? You put it down there. <laughs> Very silly. Jasper, you can come get some food in a minute here. Jasper is a perfectionist. Um, yeah, why not? I guess. And he reached his aspiration. Oh my goodness. Jasper will live longer. That's cool. We have an immortal cat boy. <laughs> Fitness level 10. An immortal perfectionist cat boy. What can I say? Same. <laughs> She also wants to play the guitar, so you can play a little guitar before you go to bed. Jam out. Jasper, you can be done working out now. You don't have to. You don't have to keep going. <laughs> oh, but maybe you need a new aspiration now, huh? Um, friend of the animal, maybe. You know what? Now that we have um, family members that have, like, seven pets, we might be able to actually complete this one. And I feel like for a cat boy, friend of the animals makes sense. So I think we're going to think we're gonna change that to be his, his current um, aspiration.
Melody, you can go to bed. Vikram is in the middle of eating. He's doing fine. How's the cow plant? Not that hungry. Perfect. Vikram, does cooking get rid of your mental fog? I don't remember. It's making something, but I don't know if it, like, counts. <laughs> Make some vegetable dumplings. Vikram, where did you put down that plate? Right there? Why? Okay, so this does get rid of his mental fog. Good. He's such a talented cook. Keep an eye on that on that cow plant to make sure that it doesn't uh, need to be fed. I am not gonna lose a sim in this household to a cow plant. Maybe in a future household, <laughs> not this one. Oh, you should probably do some programming after this, huh? Can make the game more fun, even. Sounds fun. Does it just mean your fun goes up quicker while you're playing it on that computer? That's nice. How much food do we actually have in the fridge right now? It's gotta be a ridiculous amount. <laughs> so much, so many eggs and toasts. Vikram is the only one in the house awake, actually. I think that's maybe the first time that's happened ever. Get that programming done, Victor. Oh, and then you should probably fill the dog bowls. You know, something that's bothered me about this house since I, um, I love playing someone playing a PC game and watching them play a game out of a PC game. Yeah, <laughs> the levels. And if you if you want to go even further, technically Vikram is playing The Sims as well. So you are watching me on a computer, watching Vikram on a computer, playing with another Sim on a computer. <laughs> the meta levels in this in this <laughs> right now. I think we need a nice, um, oh, no, not, not replacing the walls, thank you. Just a nice fence on, on this part of the wall. Your head just blew up. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to kill you. Mega fence deluxe. That's nice, but does it come in like a darker shade of brown? Oh, there we go. Just because I feel like there should be some railings on this stair, <laughs> on this staircase.
And those are kind of cute. Okay. Out of build mode. <laughs> the Grim Sims were playing Sims. And that's I don't even want to consider that. <laughs> it is a possibility, though. Melody, why are you awake? No, go back to bed. We got Sims, playing Sims, playing Sims. <laughs> we could technically go on with that for forever, too. They could, the Sims, Sims, Sims could be playing Sims. It's possible. <laughs> we just don't really have any control over that, you know? Actually, that wasn't he playing Sims 2? I'm pretty sure that's what, like, the, the clips of it are that are splashing across the computer screen. Which means I think we could only do it a couple of times, because in Sims 2, they're probably playing The Sims 1. And then, in Sims 1, they can't be playing The Sims, because what, what Sims would they be playing? <laughs> as far as if they're better at the game than us, they probably are. <laughs> I doubt Vikram lets his sims, um, 7% available plugged in. What? Hold on a minute here, you guys. My computer is saying that I only have 7% battery left, but it's, it's plugged in. Like, it says that it's charging but it says that I only have 7% battery and it's been going down. Um, that's no good, you know? <laughs> Let me make sure that my computer is not about to just randomly shut off in the middle of my stream, you know? That would probably be a bad thing. Oh my god, I've got to move so much stuff to get to the wire, though. <laughs> <laughs> all of all of my room right now is over in this corner. Like the rest of the room, everything over here looks nice and clean. It's because it's literally all over here. <laughs> I just kind of threw it into this corner and said, "Well, that's done. I don't need to worry about that anymore." <laughs> there we go. There it is. Everything's all plugged in. I don't know why it's telling me that it's not. 6% battery. Create some space for some air. That has um, been a problem in the past. I can put it up on there, maybe. That gives it a little bit of space for air. 